Mr. Coon, would you like to drink some prune juice? No, 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 we have a fresh cup. Fresh cup. See, look. Fresh cup. You might want the umbrella if you're going to keep covering your mouth. Just give it a whiff. Oh my god, the smell alone. I would not drink that for a billion dollars. I will. What about two billion? I've got oh, social security on social even, security. I can't watch you drink it. Oh god, no, no. Just do it. Like, How is oh. it? <laughs> it's great, it's great. Come okay. on, Mr. Coon, you can do it. For your children! <laughs> for the children! My children don't need me to drink prune juice. <laughs> Last name? Thebalt. All right, and what are you for Halloween? I'm a flapper. All right, what do flappers do? Um, I don't know. <laughs> good, it's a good costume. All right. Do flappers like to drink prune juice? No. Yes. Especially this flapper. <laughs> I think you want it. I'm going to pass. We're going to stay here until you drink it. At least give us a whiff. <laughs> How's it smell? Like prunes. Good answer. <laughs> I'm here with seniors, Grace Goodwin, and, and Bea Clinker. And what are you guys for Halloween? I'm an angry bird, homicidal Canadian, hey! <laughs> and uh, where did you get the idea for your homicidal Canadian costume? Um, it started off as a lumberjack idea, and then Grace here gave me the idea to add some maple syrup to the equation, and it evolved into this. <laughs> And uh, where did you get this uh, Angry Bird costume? Um, I was allergic to my first costume. I was Big Bird, and then I had this, so then I wore red. So are birds your favorite animal? Mm, sure. I enjoy birds, I guess. I'm here with senior... Molly Trever. Molly Trever. Have you ever had prune juice before? I don't plan on it either. You didn't really dress up much for Halloween. I'm thing one. Yeah? Yeah, my twin is thing two. Isn't that funny? That's adorable. Um... <laughs> Are you planning on trick-or-treating tonight? I'm a little old for that. You think you're too old to trick-or-treat? Probably. Well, that's all right, because I hate when you kids get on my lawn anyway. Um, if you, wh what's a good age to quit trick-or-treating at? Um, well, I'm 18, so I'm an adult, so that's probably it's a good age. A little creepy. Um, I mean, what if you're 17? Go for it. 17 it is. This is for you? It's all yours. Smell it. <laughs> Describe the smell to me, please. Prune juice. Okay. To someone who has never smelled a prune juice. Gross? I don't know. Hey, so I'm a senior. I'm Joe Vitimo. Joe, what are you for Halloween this year? I am a nurse. Why'd you decide to be a nurse? I decided to be a nurse because Halloween is the time every year to publicly embarrass yourself and look as dumb as possible. And I figure showing pasty white thighs walking around in the school for 3,000 kids looks, you know, good on a resume and makes, you know, for fun, you know? Makes Halloween a good time. Megan McCulloch. And are you a rainbow scarf for Halloween? Yes. All right, and what inspired you to wear that? My closet. Very good answer. Do you want to try some prune juice? No, thank yes, you. Yes, you do. <laughs> no, I'm good. At least give it a whiff, all right? Now drink it. <laughs> How's it smell? It's gross. <laughs> All right, well, happy Halloween. Go to Chili's. There's no more Chili's things. Okay, I'm here with senior Joanna Dumanski. And what are you for Halloween? I'm the armor guard girl. <laughs> um, can you explain this to us? Mm -mm. I mean, it speaks for itself. It does. Okay. Can you, can you armor guard for us one more time? Armor guard! <laughs> thank you, thank you. Hello, I'm with senior Alan Raznick. Okay, so what are you for Halloween? A nerd. A nerd? Okay, what do you like about nerds? They taste good. Oh, that's funny. Good job, young man. Would you like to try some prune juice? No, thank you. You sure? Yeah. You sure about that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Mr. Velskis? And what are you for Halloween? Nothing. 
No, nothing un unusual about me. Why did you not dress up today? Uh, lack of school spirit. Senior citizen. That's me. What? My teeth are like the stars. <laughs> they come out at night. Can you show us? <laughs> oh. And here we have senior... Jenna Hinsdale. And who are you for Halloween? Napoleon Dynamite. And what is Napoleon? Do you have a dance to show us too? Uh, I can try. I know some of it. Let's see it. Okay. I don't know it all. <laughs> Very nice. Happy Halloween. Um, we're here with Senior. Mike Zebel. And uh, Mike, you're new to this school, right? Yeah. How's your first year been at South? Uh, a lot of fun. Woo! Is it better than Bennett? Uh, yeah, I have more friends here than at Bennett. Woo! I like that. Awesome. Would you like some prune juice? Uh, no, thank you. We know you're probably tired from all your varsity quarterbacking, so we brought you two cups of prune juice <laughs> to replenish all your energy two times. Oh. It's high in fructose juice. <laughs> yes. That was a lie. It's a 100%. Smell it. Please. <laughs> Thank you. Whoa. Yeah. Woo. Go Mike. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. How was it? It awful. It smelled really bad too. Hi, I'm here with Senior. Parthiv Shah. So Parthiv, what are you for Halloween? Um, I'm an alien. An alien? Uh, so are you from outer space? Um, no, I'm from India, which is close enough. Oh, okay. So, what are you planning on doing tonight for Halloween? Trying to have a good time, you know, getting candy from strangers. Just living my life. Yes, you're going trick-or-treating. How old do you think you should be to stop trick-or-treating? I feel like it starts getting creepier around 40, so you should stop around there. <laughs> That's a good answer, good answer. <laughs> I'm a greaser. What's your name? Bianca Smith. What do greasers do? <laughs> um, they, hair. they cause hell. We can't swear in the senior <laughs> video, Bianca. Sorry. <laughs> do you want some prune juice? It looks like grease. <laughs> <laughs> that's disgusting. Is that? That's not grape juice. It's prune juice. Oh, I'm not having prune juice, no. Yes, you are. <laughs> didn't. At least give it a whiff. Did Dan just. No, we've got drink out of this cup. cup. No, he drank from this cup. I was going to give it to you. <laughs> it smells like raisins. Yes. It's liquid raisin. <laughs> I'll have a little bit. Mr. Cat Pee. Okay. <laughs> Shay. Yes. yes. Okay. Yay! How oh, was it? It is a liquid race. Yeah. We would go to Chili's. <laughs> and who do we have here? Andrea. That's enough. Oh, okay. Who do we have here? <laughs> here I am with Senior. Mihao Witek. All right. And why is your name pronounced differently than it's spelled? Because I'm Polish. <laughs> All right. What are you going to do for Halloween tonight? I'm going to my friend's house and we're going to watch scary movies. Good answer. And how do you like stats? I like stats. Because I do, I don't know. It's, it's, Yay! It's, go to Chili's! <laughs> Cody, Australia. And who are you for Halloween? Clara Kent. I have the glasses. Right? Yeah, I know. Oh! oh. 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 <laughs> I think you match one of our senior citizens. Life is in 3D. Yeah. Except you pop the lenses out. All right. Um, you did too. Yeah. Can we see your Superman sign? Yeah, it's not really. It's oh it's my god! Oh my totally god. different person. <laughs> yeah. And what are you gonna do for Halloween tonight? Probably just trick or treat with my friends. Good. That's good. Are you gonna drink some prune juice for us? To, to anyone else? Yes. Should I, should I just do it? Yes. yes. Here, prune, prune juice. Prune juice. Mm. And how was it? <laughs> <laughs> it was great. <laughs> Yay! Go to Chili's! Okay. Yay! <laughs> How do you feel about Luigi stomping on you and your family? It really is a sad time for my family. It's very, it's very, yeah, sad. It's very sad. Oh! Show us! Show us! <laughs> <laughs> <I> mean, <laughs> Never mind! <laughs> Does the Koopa Troopa want some prune juice? Oh, God, no. <laughs> yes, yes! Go, come on! Uh, you look like a turtle there. Oh, God. <laughs> All in her face! How was it? Not that bad.
Not that bad. You hear that? It's not that bad. All right. Does Luigi want to try it? Uh, sure. I have to move my mustache, though. All right. No, do it with the mustache. Do it with the mustache. Did Michelle just say I would drink that? Oh, your mustache is going to Oh, no, that's gross. <laughs> okay. How is it? It's like liquid raisin. Yes! You here with Senior? Alex Gaelic. What's up, Gaelic? Um, why didn't you dress up for Halloween? I couldn't find a costume. Your face is scary enough? Yeah. I didn't bring my hearing aid today. Um, do you enjoy Halloween? I love Halloween. Do you plan on trick-or-treating? Oh, yeah. That's good. Do you plan on trick-or-treating today? <laughs> yes, I do. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm here with Senior. <laughs> and what are you for Halloween? <laughs> do you know any good mime tricks? Anybody know how to get these things to move? Hit them with a cane! <laughs> oh um, are you going to trick or treat tonight? <laughs> well, if you come to my door, maybe I'll give you the silent treatment too. And I'm giving out prune juice. You want to try some? I'll pour a glass for you. Ah, uh, we got one. We got one. You can pretend to drink it while actually drinking it. <laughs> there you have it. <laughs> Hello, sir. Hello. I'm here with Senior. Christoph Bizdick. Good luck saying that one again. <laughs> what are you for Halloween? I'm Doctor Who. Hello, Doctor Who? <laughs> what? <laughs> Are you trick-or-treating tonight? Yes. That's exciting. You going with friends or by yourself? I'm going to go with some friends. And in what time period? Uh, I'm thinking the 18th century. For those of you who don't know, Doctor Who can time travel, am I right? Absolutely. Awesome. Would you like to try some prune juice? I'd rather not. There you go. <laughs> Let us know what you think. The whole cup. <laughs> All of it. I don't think so. <laughs> Just a little. Just a little. Right. More. That was not enough. That didn't even go in your mouth. You Thank got you. Chug, chug. Mmm, I'll take oh. this. How was it? Pretty awful. Yeah? Yep. I drank it for breakfast every morning. Good for you. It is. 100% juice. Hi, I'm here with Senior. I'm Mark Kalimala. And what are you for Halloween? Nothing. Why not? Because I don't really care. That's a really lame excuse. Uh, why are you wearing this lovely shirt today? Oh, because I'm running the Halloween costume contest. Yeah, who do you think is going to win? Do you think we're going to win? No. I think we're going to win. Well, that's a delusion. I'm pretty old. I don't know what's going on. It's probably the senility. All right. Oh, there goes the mustache. Here is Senior. Courtney Vizinski. And why aren't you dressed up on Halloween? Because I'm not creative. <laughs> That's so sad, I'm sorry. It's okay. And how is your fourth period going? It's really exciting. Good. How do you like stats? I love it. Do you like stats or candy more? <laughs> stats! Good answer, Mr. <laughs> King! <laughs> All right. And uh, you want to try some prune juice? Sure. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Drink more then. It's not that bad, you hear that? The whole cup, the whole cup. Come on, keep going. Chug, 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 chug. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah! Very nice, and how was that experience for you? It was great, it was absolutely great. Great, happy Halloween. Here with Senior. Hi. What's your name? I'm Vince, Vince Benedito. What are you on this special day of Halloween? I am supposed to be a... Uh, a sleepyhead, and as you can tell, oh god, you might want to give me a second to prepare myself. Okay. <laughs> I just got out of bed. Whoa! Look at him. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and yeah. You know what we have in common? What is it? <laughs> I love sleeping.
You want to try some prune juice? It always wakes me up in the morning. I don't know about that. I want to go to sleep. Sniff it. Sniff it. What's it smell like? <laughs> I don't know, but... Uh. Hi, I'm Nick. I'm also a senior. <laughs> okay, so what are you following? I'm Bane from uh, Dark Knight Rises. Awesome. So what do you like about Halloween? Uh, Halloween parties, where you get to dress up and hang out. Okay, awesome. So what else are you planning on doing the rest of today? I don't know. Maybe I'll go trick-or-treating. Okay, great. Good luck with that. <laughs> I'm going to interview Waldo if I can find him. But I can't even find my pants half the morning. Waldo! Hi! I prefer not to be on camera. Close your eyes! It ruins my book sales. Oh! <laughs> um, describe your costume to us. Hmm, well, uh, I usually wear this about every day. I never wash my clothes, and uh, I've traveled the world. Sorry, sorry. Are you planning on trick-or-treating tonight? Uh, no, I'm planning on bringing out the small children in my community. That's, that's... <laughs> Room juice? Sure, if it's in a sterile cup. It is in a sterile cup. Taste of molasses. <laughs> Thank you. You have a wonderful Halloween. You too, sir. It feels like a perfect night to dress up like hipsters and make fun of our exes. Uh uh. Uh uh. It feels like a perfect night for breakfast at midnight to fall in love with strangers. Uh uh. Uh uh. Yeah. We're happy, free, confused, and lonely. Same time, it's miserable and magical. Oh, yeah. Tonight's the night when we forget about the deadlines. It's time. Uh oh. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. Everything will be alright if you keep me next to you. You don't know about me, but I'll bet you won't.
Garrett. I'm standing here with senior Scott Mitchell. So, Scott, what do you have any Valentine's Day plans for tonight? Uh, you know, tonight I'm actually single, so I'll be prowling the streets looking for women, uh, trying out my new pickup lines. Ooh, what's this new pickup line? Um, Rachel, did you just fart? <laughs> nope. Because you just blew me away. <laughs> thank you, thank you. So, um, I heard a little rumor that you did some very good dancing earlier today. Oh, uh, that is true. I actually won, um, free dance tickets for the turnabout dance. Ooh, so he is single and now he has dance tickets. So, maybe to impress some ladies, could you try some dance moves out for us? I'd need a beat or something. Someone drop a beat? <laughs> 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 Thank you. That was beautiful. All right. So will we see you on any award show soon for getting some? Maybe um, so you think you can dance? Hopefully, yeah. If my, uh, yeah. I don't have a really good answer for that, but yeah. All right. We hope to see you in the television industry soon. Thank you very much for your time. I have a question for you. Yeah. Did it hurt? Did what hurt? When you fell from heaven? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> Wow. Um, um, all right. I don't really, I don't really know what to say to that. Um, anyway, um, yeah. Okay. So, do you have any plans for Valentine's Day? No, unfortunately. That's good. You're just gonna sit at home alone, watch movies, cry. Yeah, and some ice cream. Oh, good. Good. That's always good. Um, yeah. Well, I hope you have a nice night. Thank you, Ryan. All right. And if you're uh, if you're feeling down, you know, I'm just a few streets away. That's so creepy. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Have a good night. Hi, I'm here with Senior. Lauren White. And Lauren, what are your plans for this Valentine's Day? I'm um, just staying home this weekend. I'm uh, visiting my boyfriend in college. That's it. Fine, fine. Um, do you have any pickup lines for us? No. Sorry. <laughs> okay, well, thanks. I'm so boring. Here with Senior. Laurel. All right, Laurel. Here are four crush cans that you received on this Valentine's Day. How do you feel? I feel awesome. Do you know who got them for you? Yeah. Do you? Who was it? Miranda and myself. <laughs> Miranda and yourself? Yeah. How many did Miranda get you? Three. And you bought one for yourself? I was. <laughs> Thirsty, so I bought it. <laughs> okay. Can you uh, open them up and read them for us? No. If you don't do it, I'm going to do it, so. Why do I have to? <laughs> Just one. Just one okay. of them. One is fine. It's broken. Um, it doesn't say anything. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you, you can read the back though. I've got a crush on you. Ooh. Do you have a crush on yourself or does Miranda have a crush on you? <laughs> she has a crush on me. Oh. Well, what are your plans for this Valentine's Day? Um, we're gonna go to practice. Well, have fun at practice, Sorrell. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Hi, I'm here with Senior. Connor Bailey. And Connor, what are you doing right now? We're delivering crush cans. And what are crush cans? They are cans of soda, <laughs> flavored uh, strawberry, orange, or grape. And we deliver them during Valentine's Day as a fundraiser for Key Club. And did you send anyone a crush can this year? I did. Who? <laughs> my girlfriend, and my sister, and my friends from Key Club. Fun stuff. Thanks, Connor. Are you a tamale? Because you're hot. Um, thank, thank you. Thank you. You got any plans for Valentine's Day? Ah, mm. uh, not really. All right, well, uh, enjoy your night alone. Um, maybe next year? Maybe next year. All right, good luck, kid. Thank you. Thank Keep you it up. It. Now, if you were to choose from one of these four people to get a val Valentine's Day kiss, which one would you choose? Probably Rob. Well, it's your lucky day, because that's about to happen. Oh! Thank you, Rob. I appreciate it. Wow! Well, Mike, happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Senior. Tommy Berry. And I hear that you have a good pickup line for us. Uh, yeah, in German, auf Deutsch. <laughs> Ruf mich an. And what does that mean? Call me. <laughs> and do you have any special Valentine's Day plans tonight? I'm working at 4 o'clock. That's really romantic. Yeah, you should come to Carabas and I'll seat you and your uh, darling for Valentine's Day dinner. Here with Senior. Annie Hennigan. And how are you spending your Valentine's Day? 
Going out to dinner with my boyfriend. Oh, where are you guys going? Uh, Papado. What time? Six, and then we're seeing Safe Haven. Safe Haven. That's a, a lot of people have said that so far today. It looks pretty good. Oh. Can I ask you a quick question? Yes. Can I give you a kiss? No, because my boyfriend will kill you. <laughs> okay. Well, here's a kiss anyway. Thanks. Yeah, bye. I'm here with senior Monica Wojak. So, Monica, do you have any special Valentine's Day plans tonight? Um, you know, just sitting at home with my cat. <laughs> just eat some chocolate with myself. It's fine. Does your cat have a name? Oh yeah, Vincent. <laughs> and um, what do you think your is your are you gonna give your cat anything for Valentine's Day? Oh yeah, for sure. Give him some mice and stuff, little plastic toys. You know. Good. Do you have any pickup lines you would like to try out on me? On me. Um. Oh, wait, these are like inappropriate, is that okay? <laughs> oh, yeah, um, come. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, like, he says yes, so. Oh, like the Hogwarts one, it was like, <laughs> what was that? It was like, can I s okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> we, woo! Commercial break, commercial break. Um, speaking of space aliens, are you one? No. Because it seems like you've abducted my heart. Oh, oh that's sweet, Rob. <laughs> you're sweet. Actually, you're so sweet, I think you're giving me a toothache. Is this scripted? No, no, this is, this is all out of the top of my head. Uh, do you have any Valentine's Day plans? I'm going to go home. Actually, no, I'm going to go to the gym. Then I'm going to go home and eat and sleep and then play trombone. That sounds nice. You're going to sleep before playing trombone? Are you going to sleep again afterwards? Yes. Okay, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Um, I mean, that's a good way to spend your Valentine's Day. Alone and sad and alone. Yes, but I have comic books and fictional characters. You don't need anything else, am I right? That's right. All right, happy Valentine's, happy Valentine's Day. Day. Here with Senior. Kaylee Lucan. And how are you spending your Valentine's Day this year? I think I'm going to go to Chipotle. They give you a free entree if you kiss the person you go with. So. Who are you going with? I haven't decided yet. You haven't <laughs> decided yet. So you're just, you're just yeah. planning that someone's going to say yeah. yes? Yeah, that's the goal. Are, who are you hoping you'll go with? Oh, I don't know. You don't know yet? No. <laughs> Apparently Rob wants to go with me, and I'm not sure. <laughs> Is that a possibility? I don't know. I don't know. We'll, <laughs> oh. well, out of the four of us, oh. who would you choose? <laughs> I include myself, yes. <laughs> who would you choose for your Valentine's Day kiss? Oh. This is hard. Okay, Rob, since kindergarten we've been friends. <laughs> and how do you feel about that? I feel pretty good. Do you think you're going to get a free burrito later? I hope so. <laughs> I do. I like that. I want a free burrito. Yeah, all right. Well, have a good Valentine's Day. You too. I'm here with Senior. I'm Kristen Grievous. <laughs> and you, have, you got a crush can? And um, would you like to read the crush can for us? Sure. Can get it open. Ooh. Have a delightful day. I love always your secret admirer. Ooh. Ooh. And what does the front of the crush can or the card say? We belong together. Oh, very nice. Do you have any plans for Valentine's Day? Um, going to the movies. Oh, fun. What movie are you gonna see? I have no idea. <laughs> okay. Here with senior Jordan Vosicki. And what do you, how are you spending this Valentine's Day? Uh, I'm going to go see a movie. What movie? Um, I don't know yet. You don't know yet, but you have a plan to go? Yep. Step one, done. Check. Is there dinner involved? Uh, no. Is it with a girl or by yourself? With a girl. With a girl. That's fun. That's fun. That's fun. Um, so, out of these people over here, who would you choose for your Valentine's Day kiss? Rob Gagala. Jordan, let me tell you, it's your lucky day. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm here with Senior. Danielle Conrad. Can you give us a pickup line? Um, well, this is for PJ White. Um, <laughs> do you believe in love at first sight or should I walk by again? Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's so obvious. Time he's oh, yeah. Is he going to be your Valentine? Uh, no. <laughs> Hi, I'm here with Senior. Duo. Can you give us a pickup line? Uh. Wait, I don't know. <laughs> Do you have a French? Give me the French pickup line. Are you no. a beaver? Are, are, you a, are you a beaver? <laughs> Hot damn. Do you have any special Valentine's Day plans? Nope. No Valentine's? Nope. 
All right. <laughs> Thank you. I'm here with senior Claire Agazzino. Okay, Claire, I have a very important question for you. If you could go to prom with any of these three lovely gentlemen, which one would you choose? Oh, this is really hard. I don't know. I would say Dan. <laughs> Point Dan Leahy. Yeah. I'm here with senior. Arnold Johnson. Okay, Arnold. So prom is coming up in a few weeks. So are you planning on going? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, do you have any plans for after prom? Um, I was thinking about just going, hanging out with a few friends after prom, you know, the usual thing. Okay, cool. So I have a question. How long does it take for guys to get ready for prom? Um, I would say less than an hour, to be honest. I mean, it doesn't take much for us to get ready. Okay, okay. Okay, so what are you most excited about for prom? Um, I'm most excited about, I don't know, uh, dancing, I guess, seeing friends, dressed up and looking snazzy. Awesome, awesome. Okay, thanks, Arnold. I hope you have an awesome prom. All right, thank you. I'm here with Senior. John Drevenny. And John, do you have prom plans this year? Yeah, you know, whatever it does. Is this your first prom? It is not. This is my second. Oh, when did you go? Last year. And how was that? It was, it was wonderful. Very wonderful. Do you think this year will be better or worse than last year? I have no idea. Hopefully, probably better because I'm a senior this year, so, I mean, you know. That's good. And who are you going with? Uh, Monica Salad Buns. She's a good-looking girl. She, she's pretty good-looking. I'm excited for you. I hope you have a great time. Maybe I'll see you there. Maybe Absolutely. we can dance a little bit. Yeah, no, no, of course. We will. Well, that'll happen. Just save me that last dance, all right? Can't wait. Hopefully, I don't. Here with Senior. Bianca Smith. Now, Bianca, are you ready for prom? Uh, I'm getting there. You're getting, yeah. you're getting there. Do you have a dress picked out? I do have a dress. It's hanging up in my room. Yeah. Now, how long did it take you, approximately, to find this dress? I think I tried on about, like, 15 dresses, and it was the last one I tried on. The last one. I would... Yeah. yeah. What color is it? It's black, actually. It's black. It's wow. Black. It's like my heart. Your heart. You have a black heart. Yeah. I have a black heart. So now, who's this lucky lad who will be going to prom with you? <laughs> um, well, he hasn't asked me yet, but it's my boyfriend. Oh, so it is a significant other. It is. That is nice. It is nice. Yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> yes. So approximately how long will it take you to get ready on this day? I'm, I think I'm going to take the entire day. The uh, entire day? Yeah, just like from start to finish. i got to wake up in the morning. I'll probably like sleep with my makeup on. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think, I think I'm just going to take the whole day. The whole day. The whole day. Well, Bianca, I hope you have a great time at prom. Oh, thank you, Joe. Thank you. Here with Senior, Chris Roos. Now, Chris, are you ready for prom? Oh, I'm totally ready. Yeah, you're ready? Do you have a date? I do, actually, of today. As of today, yeah. um, what did you do to ask her? Um, well, I had like a present wrapped, and inside of it there were balloons. So when she opened it up, they came out and had no attached to it. And then I came out with flowers. Wow, that's one lucky girl. <laughs> she said yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. That's good. That's good. Now, do you think the two of you will be as cute as our fine couple here? I don't know. It's going to be hard, but um, you're not matching, really. Um, Excuse you? I think I'll match a little better. but So is matching something that's very important? I told you blue. Okay. Is matching something that's very important? I think matching is pretty important. I mean, if you're not matching it, those pictures are going to look awful. I mean, awful. Kind of like theirs are. Thing. Okay. Hello, I'm standing here with Senior. Sammy. Alex. Jane. So girls, prom is quickly approaching. I was wondering, do any of you guys have any prom plans or prom dresses or dates? No, I'm wearing a potato sack. Is your potato sack as pretty as my dress? Obviously it's better. Yeah, mine's better. It's made of Egyptian uh, velvet, thank you. Do you have any prom plans? Um, I have my dress. You have a dress. Do you have a date, perhaps? Yes, I have a date. Are you, are you very good friends with this date? Yeah. Yeah, yes. is he your... Um, is he your significant other? No, he's not my significant other. Do you have a significant other you're taking to prom? Oh, yeah. Yeah? You yeah. do? That's good. So you guys are like kind of like a thing? I guess so. I don't know. That's cute. Do you plan on having him be your significant no, I other? I plan on having him be your significant other. <laughs> All right. Are you excited for prom with her? Yeah. And have you asked her yet? No, not yet. How do you plan on doing that? Uh, it might be tonight, actually. So. Woo! Do you have any any uh, hints on how you're going to do it? There might be stars involved. Stars? This man's going to space <laughs> for this girl. You know they're destined to be. Here with seniors. Stephanie Copeland. Jack LeBaron. Now, are you two ready to go to prom? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you guys going with each other? No. No. 
same group. Yeah. Group. So you both have dates though. Yep. Now, Jack, did you ask somebody already? Uh, informally. I'm going for the uh, flashy stuff later. Oh, flashy stuff later. And Stephanie, have you been asked? No, not yet. But but it'll happen. I know who I'm going with, so okay. it's okay. <laughs> so now, a topic that's always brought up at dances is an appropriate way to dance. Um, what are some appropriate styles you guys think are, like, in the dance? What's a good way to keep it good for all the viewers? Um, you know, some nice, like, like arms length, yeah. like that. You, know, you want to leave space for the Mustang way. <laughs> yeah. Oh, space for the Mustang way, I like that. Now, how do you feel our senior class will start dancing? Do you think that's appropriate? Yeah. Well, maybe not so much
Robert Morris. Okay, Robert, so what are you for Halloween? Dante Ash from Assassin's Creed. Okay, so what does he do? He jumps off buildings and kills people. Okay, well that's not very nice. Are you going to kill anyone today on Halloween? No, but I will be on top of buildings. Are you going to kill this oh. cup of prune juice? <laughs> kill it. Kill it, just, just check. Oh, yeah.